Hello, and welcome to another Porter's Marvel Legends review. Today, we could be looking at Marvel Legends Galactus Build-A-Figure series, Nightcrawler. Now, um, this Nightcrawler is, I guess, the classic 90s costume. Um, I don't think Nightcrawler really had all that many different kinds of costumes. But I don't care, because when I think of Nightcrawler, he's in this costume. The nice V and the white gloves and boots with the little red around it. Nice shoulder pads. So, let's get a close-up of uh, this figure. If I can stand him up. And then I can zoom in there in his face. Pretty good sculpt. He looks pissed off. Pretty, pretty cool. Nice muscle definition. Uh, nice overall pants, although in the gloves there. You can see where the, the black circle is indented in the gloves. It's a little bit off. You can see. Right there, right there. Right there. But, uh, not very nice. Now, it does have a tail, which is a. has a wire in it, so you can bend it. It's like a rubber with a wire. So you can pretty much bend it all anywhere you want. That's cool. Um, articulation wise, he's got a lot of good articulation. His head can go up. So, about, about that far. Down, about that far. Can also rotate 360 degrees. Arms move out. They do get hindered by the little shoulder pads but they're of a softer plastic so they're not too terribly bad I can go forward at a slight angle and backward at a slight angle rotate 360 degrees at the upper part of the bicep double jointed uh, elbows full 360 uh, uh, swivel at the end of the glove the and can go up, down, and the finger fingers can move individually. It also has a torso joint which goes 360 degrees. He also has a crunch which can go forward and back. Mine doesn't go too too well. It does have a full 360 waist joint. Let's go forward back, side, rotate upper part of the thigh, double jointed knees, upper part of the boot, there's a 360 degree swivel, and the feet are really good. They can go back uh, that far, forward that far, uh, uh, side to side very well. Uh, the back heel can go uh, uh, up and down and so can uh, the front part of the foot can go up, down, and both of the toes are individually articulated. So, um, overall very good articulation for um, this uh, figure. Uh, it's nice to have a, night, a good poseable nightcrawler um, because, you know, nightcrawler does have those kinds of poses where, um, you know, require, you know, a lot of dynamic uh, situations. Like when he's teleporting or, you know, he's acrobat, he's an acrobat. So, it, it would make sense, you know, if he would have, you know, some, a good degree of mobility. But... I'm going to set my camera back down.
Oh, the paint's pretty nice too. Uh, did some of these, these nice, uh, nice, nicely painted eyes. I don't know if you can see them at all. Nicely yellow painted eyes. He has blue streaks throughout his hair. Um, the only thing that I have a problem with is the circles on his boots are a little off painted. Um, th this is a little bit over bled than that one, as you can see. This one, uh, all these dots are kind of off. This this one's a little bit better on his left arm, but the right one's not not all that good. But hey, it's okay. Uh, uh, I got this figure when I was a kid, so I didn't really look too much uh, on that. I don't even remember seeing more than just one of Nightcrawler. So, um, yeah, I don't know if, um, I don't know if there was any, there were even better. I don't know, I was a kid, you know, when you're a kid and you buy toys, you don't really, uh, look too much on the paint job or they just make sure everything's really kinda there and you know. But uh there you have the Marvel Legends Nightcrawler. See you guys.